In 1998, Neil and Tim Finn came to Chiyomitu for the opening of the museum's exhibition, True Colors. As part of the opening, the Finns performed an acoustic set at the Waipa District Council Chambers and shared a few memories of their hometown. We've just seen the exhibition, and it's really a great exhibition. It's very concise, comprehensive, and, and has the style and the flair that, you know, we, we feel comfortable with. So, very pleased about that. <laughs> It's a great paint job. <laughs> yeah. Um, so yeah, I mean, we'd like to sing a couple of songs, but first maybe just say a couple of brief words. We, for me, I guess, I'd like to thank my parents for creating an environment where we could learn about music and, and uh, be encouraged to get into music, because I think it all starts there. So thanks a lot, Mum and Dad, and uh, for your undying and just ceaseless. Uh, support really, even when Spillian's first started and Dad was fined at Rotary for having a son that looked like me. <laughs> <laughs> he never said, when are you going to get a real job? So, pretty cool. Yeah. Most of his friends did though. <laughs> <laughs> and also I'd like to thank the teachers that I had in, in Tiamu that particularly inspired me, um, Sister uh, Raymond, who was a pretty groovy nun and she, um, <laughs> she let me learn a bit of kind of loose improvisational sort of music and really kick-started it and then there was Chuck Fowler who Dad uh, put me on to. He taught me about chords and improvising and uh, Sister Catherine and Sister Sebastian, a couple of really good teachers as well. So they really got it. A good teacher is everything really for a kid. I think they can really inspire you. I was lucky with those ones. And uh, yeah, what do you reckon then? Well, that's good. I'll just thank you. I, I'd like to um, thank a couple of people as well who uh, were connected with my musical education and uh, inspiration um, after Tim had long gone to boarding school. And that was Connie Nicholson who, um, who taught me piano and uh, for about three years. And she was a fantastic teacher, as most people in TMD would know. And in fact, I was lucky enough to attend her, I think it was her 80th birthday, was it? 90th birthday. Um, that was not so long ago. But anyway, she was a great teacher and um, I went through fondly back at those those piano lessons. And also I'd like to thank Felicity Saxby who um, was kind of running what was called the All and Some Folk Club in those days and I got to know her and her family and they were always very warm and very kind to me and we had many, many very long and enjoyable hours playing songs out at her place and at folk festivals all around New Zealand. So, And that was the Tiamudu connection, Dean and Robin Taylor too, who taken part in the exhibition have always kept me in touch with what's going on in Tiamudu. Although, I don't get back that much, I still feel quite connected to the place, so thanks for all coming down. I'd like yeah, to thanks. also thank Mum and Dad and the family. And Tim and it was a very cool place to grow up. Small town, big dreams. Um, <laughs>